supposed to eat first because now even if i believe you are supposed to eat first the resounding slaps of my mom i can still feel it in my you are not just supposed to eat first hey hey i don't mind i wait everybody chop finish i go to the pot don't even remove don't scrape it take a spoon see that not even fake fake will disrespect you i always get the bottom of the pot i used to get the first spoon bottom pot is the bomb it's called the salad pot the bottom is the best come on guys Can you see anything? No. Oh, that smells good. I think there's vegetables in my mind. Yes, Momo, are you serious? Okay, okay. Uh, uh, Tani Moshe, where is Momo? So let's make the decision. What part of the pot is this? Top. This is not the bottom of the pot. I say bottom. I think it's three quarter. It's not the top, it's not the middle, it's not the bottom. We're like at the bottom of the pot. Is it the bottom of the pot? Definitely. Welcome back, viewers. Small scale business and business that are still growing or in the first stage of growing. Join me as we well have a chat with Mr. Greg Edan, the owner of Forge Kitchen, a small scale business. Okay, so I'd like to know what, uh, what the 
When you ask me what it takes to start a business or what it, what it takes to, to start something like this, there are numbers. Uh, for me, I think it's a determination. It doesn't matter how much the volume of money you have. Yeah, huh. it's, if the determination is not there, you cry, you'll be discouraged. The determination comes before the resources. Uh, yeah. So what can you tell us? What can you tell us? Yeah, I mean, your questions are much now. What? In terms of resources? Uh, I started a business, you know, 250,000. Uh, that's what I said, that it's not their money. And I will also have it the same design with more than that. I can, at that time, I can also start it something less than that. What drives me was the motivation. The determination you have. So you keep pressing up. The determination is that you know you can do it. The confidence is there. And the opportunity is there, everything is there. But if you have all these things, when you are not determined to do it, there will be a lot of challenge, a lot of factors. Because the determination will always keep you focused, keep you going, keep you ahead. So, is there any challenge? Yeah, yeah, it's a challenge and normal. Challenge are normal in every sector there are challenge. If you are asking me personally, uh, well, financial is not it has been a normal challenge it's to every business person. Uh, uh, effective workforce is another function of the I think those are the two major challenges to my level that I face. And also, probably you can move on to the environment challenge, where you will be constrained to a lot of things. The norms of people might not really enable you to function. <laughs> We are determined to face our depression gradually by or bit by bit. So, what are your advice to those who are thinking this same life? Our advice to people, first of all, get inside of anything you intended doing. Have knowledge of everything. I think that will help you sustain you. But you don't have the inside, I mean, knowledge of how things you want. And you can't do business, no matter how little it is, without focusing, scanning, assisting, knowing what and how to do things, how to care about it, and how to produce it and who to sell it for. Have your target audience, those are just easy. And environment find out. I think that is my first advice. And the other aspect was that what keeps you going, as I said, is the single determination. Even if you start it, because there are many business that will start or you can move to, and along the line, you will be scared. And you are determined to face every challenge that will come and keep working strong. Thank you very much. Now, I'd like to chip in my own quarter to the youth out there who don't actually need to wait for the government to venture into any business. As I was rightly said, we started with those small scales that we just got into the children of the 2000s. And with this, we have come to the end of today's edition of the show. And to the viewers out there, we appreciate you for keeping a date with us. And until next week, I am your host, Oushad on Standard TV.